I'm Penny Walter. I'm a puppeteer here in the Great Northwest. I was born in Walla Walla, Washington, and grew up in Spokane. It is fun when people ask, oh, what do you do for a living? I actually look forward to that question, and I'm always like, well, I'm a puppeteer. I think I first knew I wanted to be a puppeteer probably when I was five years old and saw my first puppet show. And I was totally addicted to the Muppets and Sesame Street growing up. Um, and I played with puppets um, up until about seventh and eighth grade when it just wasn't cool anymore. With oh here and oh there. And then I quit playing with my dolls and I didn't rediscover them again until I was almost 30. Before I was a professional puppeteer, I was a teacher in a kindergarten, first grade mixed classroom, and I really enjoyed doing that. Uh, I started bringing the puppets in, and I realized that uh, they were magical. And when I started working with the puppets so much, and here I am encouraging the children to follow their natural gifts, um, and I realized that I needed to follow mine. So I decided to quit and become a professional puppeteer. <laughs> Throughout my career, I've just been really um, lucky uh, or blessed. I, I was at the Portland Children's Museum for four years, uh, really grew an audience and learned a lot during the time that I was there, which was great for a transition to go out on my own. Penny's Puppet Productions is a one-woman puppet theater started in 2002 that produces many musicals. It's a combination of entertainment and education, and that we call that edutainment. So it's a playful way of learning. I perform at birthday parties and libraries and schools. Puppetry for me is I really just let the puppets come through me and I, I just let my imagination go and I try to lose the ego and uh, not worry about what people are thinking about the crazy puppeteer behind the curtain. I try to just, what does that puppet need to say and how do they need to move right at this time and just kind of let it come through my hands. I enjoy so many things about the show, different aspects. Um, creating the shows, that's really fun and challenging for me and trying to figure out what kids might like and also that stimulates the adults. I love putting on the show and, and all of that, but probably my favorite part is after the show when um, the puppets get to meet the kids and the, the kids get to touch the puppets and pet them, maybe ask them questions, and that's such an intimate moment that's really, all I can say is magical. It's just very sweet and joyful and um, touching. What about my tail? I have a whale of a tail. Want to see it? I think puppets are a powerful teaching tool because children are able to suspend that disbelief. They sleep with stuffed animals. They love cartoons, and they're just believing whatever this creature is right in front of them. You know, is it a real squirrel? Yeah, it's a real squirrel. Okay, they just accept that. And I found that when I was teaching, I could ask the children to clean up without the puppet and they would kind of fight me on it, but I would put a puppet on my arm and um, ask him, oh, I need help putting these blocks away. And they would help the puppet put the blocks away. So they just, it's more fun. Howdy, everybody. My name is Rough and Tumble, but you folks can call me R.T. Yee-ha! Hi, my name is Donkey. Uh, hi, everybody. My name is Frank the Mouse, and I love cheese. Nothing better than cheddar. It's so gouda. I have over 500 puppets. It's kind of an obsession. I, I kind of consider them friends. Um, I feel a little guilty when I put them away in the box. Nutty the squirrel is almost like my real pet. Um, the kids always ask me, does he have a little nest? And I'm like, oh yes, he has a nest. And um, heaven forbid there's ever a fire or anything, because that would really be brokenhearted. I know I could replace them, but I just love my puppets. <gasps> oh. Hi, my name is Buzzy, Buzzy the Bee. Can everyone say hi, Buzzy? The best thing about being a puppeteer, I think, is um, that I get to laugh every day I go to work and uh, share laughter. Everybody, what sound does a bee make flying backwards? Here, here, I'll show you. Zoom, 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 zoom. <laughs> I try to make my shows fun for everybody. 
and uh, that means from zero to 99, I try to make sure that uh, there's a laugh for everyone. <laughs> and all of you were a great audience. Give yourself a round of applause. After leaving a Penny's puppet show, I, I really hope people have joy in their heart with this Thank shared you. experience they just had. You. you know, just laughing together, I think, is a magical moment for families. It's really satisfying to me when families keep coming back to the shows again and again and again. Uh, I feel that I've really touched them in a positive way. I think so. I'm not sure if um... I feel like I was born to do this job. I think I've found my joy and I'd like to share it with others because I think when you share your gift that inspires others to share theirs and hopefully that makes the world a better place. If you have an idea for Northwest Profiles, send it to KSBS-TV, 3911 South Regal, Spokane, Washington, 99223. Northwest Profiles is a presentation of KSBS Public Television.